Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how to work with scroll views. A good part about scroll views is there is no need for any Java code. It's all pre-written in the XML just for you. So here is my app running. I have a text view and a button and then a scroll view with a text view button and then a bunch more text views built in. Now I'm going to show you how to achieve what I have done. Well, you're going to need to go to your layout and find your activity that you're going to want to put your scroll view into. Go to design. And I guess I can delete these items right here. So, first of all, note we are in linear layout. It doesn't necessarily matter what layout you're using. Just have a layout. So, go down here and keep scrolling, keep scrolling. And then you should find a scroll view. Once you have the scroll view found, click on it and drag it into your screen. Please note, scroll view can only have one direct child, meaning you can't just keep throwing text views in there or buttons or whatever. You need to put in another layout like linear layout or relative layout. So that's what we're going to do. I'm going to throw in my linear layout and then I can add plain text views or buttons or whatever you prefer to the linear layout. So as you can see I'm just dragging them in and now you're seeing they're stacking up. While you guys weren't looking I went ahead and threw in quite a few extra buttons and text views and that kind of thing. So now if we go to our app we can see that we can actually scroll in here. Notice that there's two that are not scrolling. Well why is that? Well they're not in our linear layout and they're not in our scroll view, they're actually above it. You can insert anything else above or below the scroll view, it doesn't really matter. Only the things in the scroll view will be scrolling in the app. So if you have any questions or something that makes sense, please feel free to comment below in the comments. Tell me about it, ask me whatever question you have, and I'd be glad to see if I can answer it. So until next time, I'll see you in the next video.